build anything, one must follow a careful process to think, design, and implement. The same is true for a nation that strives to develop its key asset, its people. The people who shape a nation's civilization and lead the path to the future where technology is the universal language that drives all human development and empowerment. With this conviction, the Ministry of Communications and Information Technology developed a diverse portfolio of IT training programs that catered to different age groups and backgrounds. And through our partnerships with leading global training academies, we are able to deliver state-of-the-art programs such as Next Technology Leaders and the demand-driven tech jobs initiative, Wazifa Tech, and many more. Our nationwide footprint of laboratories has enabled us to train and create unique work opportunities for Egyptian talent in local and international companies, thereby bridging the gap among youth across the country. And thanks to the wealth of young trained talent, Egypt is now a leading destination for BPO and IT services outsourcing. In fact, more than 230,000 young men and women are behind a $3.2 billion export industry serving more than 100 countries in 20 different languages. And because digital innovation is shaping the future, we are empowering our young people and unleashing their entrepreneurial potential through a number of initiatives. Four tech cities were developed in different governorates across the country. IT innovation hubs are being created in eight universities outside Cairo to give students and the community access to resources that support innovation and entrepreneurship. In parallel, we are building the Knowledge City at the heart of our new administrative capital, which will be home to knowledge sharing and creative IT solutions. Egypt's wealth of creativity in the field of ICT was key when the United Nations selected Cairo to host its first technology innovation lab in Africa. This was launched by the President of Egypt in December of 2017. Through this lab and many others, we seek to foster electronics design and manufacturing in Egypt. And because human development has always been at the heart of our strategy and as a champion of inclusivity, MCIT enabled 60 inclusive community centers with technologies that served and trained 20,000 citizens in remote and underserved areas. We are also building the capacity of our people with special needs through assistive technologies at the National Academy of IT for people with disabilities. Additionally, we are deploying technologies to support remote diagnosis and facilitate medical care for our people. To fulfill our ambitious plans, we must have resilient IT infrastructure across Egypt to help us build smart cities and strengthen connectivity for our citizens wherever they are. Therefore, MCIT, together with Telecom Egypt, upgraded the communications network and is extending fiber optic cables across the country. And in record time, we managed to connect more than 2,500 high schools in all governorates across Egypt. This spans over 4,500 kilometers of fiber optic cables and reinforces the value and importance of developing the education in our country. MCIT aims at building a productive, inclusive and creative digital society that drives socio-economic development. In this digital society, Government services will be streamlined by maintaining an integrated database across all government entities so that citizens are able to receive services and pay with ease, quality and speed without having to provide detailed information. And to ensure equal access to all Egyptians regardless their backgrounds and lifestyles, 
citizens will be served through different platforms. Mobile applications, digital platforms, call centers, government service centers, or Egypt Post branches. Currently, Egypt Post offers an advanced array of postal, financial, and government services. For example, the biometric ATM facilitates transactions for citizens, especially the elderly, through voice commands and secure fingerprint authentication. The ITM allows citizens to open postal and financial accounts to get debit cards and thereby enhances financial inclusion. Now citizens can also pay their electricity, telephone and traffic fees from home by using POS services. Or they can leverage the EasyPay application which uses the scan to pay technology to pay via mobile phone. Egypt Post also established an e-commerce platform called Il Barid Mall to support small and medium businesses in marketing, selling and delivering their goods. We are the youth, the ones who continue to learn, create and seek to build a better Egypt for all. As long as we continue to develop, we are sure that we are on the right track. ومن اجلهم نسعى بكل ما اوتينا من عزم لبناء الجسر القوي الذي يعبر بهم وباحلامهم نحو الامل والمستقبل.